This morning, California police confirmed the suspect in the mass shooting outside of Los Angeles was found dead of an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound. Ten people were killed, ten others hurt. Authorities are trying to figure out what sparked the rampage Saturday night now being called the deadliest mass shooting since the Uvalde school massacre. And Cleo Green is with us right now in studio. Cleo, there are so many questions this morning. Yeah, there's still a lot of questions that need to be answered, Kara. That shooting, I mean, it was supposed to be a huge celebration on Saturday night that ended in a deadly massacre here. That shooting happened inside of this dance hall building in the midst of Lunar New Year celebrations. It's a total shock to the Asian American community. And of course, you know, people are responding on social media. We know at least five men and five women were killed. Many believed to be over the age of 50. This tweet here from Stop AAPI Hate, Asian American Pacific Islander Hate, saying our community has faced so much tragedy and trauma over the last several years. This tremendous act of violence on one of the most important days of the year for many Asian Americans at a place where Asian American families come to gather and celebrate is truly sending shockwaves throughout our community. New this morning, we're learning that the suspect has been identified as 72 year old who can tran if this is video and, and pictures from towards California tactical teams they can be seen closing in on this white van in an empty parking lot tran was found dead from a self inflicted gunshot wound we're also learning after that shooting Saturday night tran actually drove to another dance hall nearby where some people actually grabbed his weapon and fought him off before he escaped again now this morning investigators they are still searching for a motive president Joe Biden is ordering that all flags be flown at half staff until Thursday in honor of the Monterey Park victims. The president also saying he and the first lady are praying for those victims and their families. Mark, once again, we are waiting for the full details on that motive. I'll yes. send it back to you. Yeah, terrible story. Thank you for that, mm -hmm. Cleo.